they have. Uh, uh, Stephen. Mr. Spencer would like a word with you. Sir. My good man, I have a question for you. Yes, sir. Do you suppose the debt situation regarding America is a significant factor in the present low levels of trade? Or do you suppose this is a red herring and that the abandonment of the gold standard is at the root of the problem? I'm sorry, sir, but I'm unable to be of assistance in this matter. Oh, dear, what a pity. Well, perhaps you can help us on another matter. Oh, no. Do you think that the currency problem in Europe would be alleviated by an arms agreement between the French and the Bolsheviks? I'm sorry, sir, but I'm unable to be of assistance in this matter. Very well, Stevens and Bill. Uh, one moment, Darlington, I have another question to put to our good man here. <laughs> My good fellow, do you share our opinion that Monsieur de Ladier's recent speech on the situation in North Africa was simply a ruse to scupper the nationalist fringe of his own domestic party? I'm sorry, sir. I'm unable to be of assistance in any of these matters. You see, gentlemen, our good man here is unable to assist us in these matters. And yet, we still go along with the notion that this nation's decisions be left in the hands of our good man here and a few millions like him. <laughs>